Alright guys, welcome back. So in today's video, we're going to look at how we can simply close the keyboard by tapping around in the view. So we just started by creating a new Xcode project and I just called it Dismiss Keyboard. And then I just drug in a text field, expanded the width a little bit, gave it a placeholder. And then I went into my view controller, I added an extension of type UI view controller. And I created two functions. The first is called uh, Hide Keyboard or Hides Keyboard. And that just creates a UI tab gesture recognizer. Um, that we add to our view. So as you see here in a moment, we add it to our view. And we created another function called dismiss keyboard where we just force the end editing on the view. And when we load it here in a minute and you see when we t uh, first tap, nothing happens when we click off the keyboard. But if we go back into our code and inside of our view to load, we need to add our self that hides keyboard. And when we do that, you see that it will go away here in a moment. So right here we add it, self.hides keyboard. And when we rerun it, and we enter some text this time, you can see that uh, after we enter the text and we go to click in the view, it'll dismiss the uh, keyboard. Okay, so just to clarify the code a little bit, we have an extension of UI view controller and it creates two functions. Our first hides keyboard, and inside of that function we create a variable called tap, which is a UI tap gesture recognizer and we give it an action called dismiss keyboard and then we also add um, that recognizer to the view and then we create a second function of a uh, objective C and essentially what that does is it forces um, the ending on the view to stop and then we just add it into our view to load.